All right, it's recording. Just testing. One, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. All right. Hello, people. Sadly, we're not we're not doing the stream this time. We'll do that later. Today is the ultimate time for a reaction to Samantha's storyline, aka the massive adventures of Samantha and her shenanigans. I thought I was the first person to comment here as I checked. Yeah, right. This is when she got. A, this is like continues after when she got expelled and arrested. Okay, we see Gerald here and her mom. Gerald, here. I need. Like seriously, this is what this is what happens after the um when she got expelled and arrested, but her mom, at least her mom cared for her. I need to talk to you immediately. Oh. Hello, mom. What's up? Well, I never expected this was to be Brian. Well, here is what's up. Your sister Samantha has recently been arrested for beating up another student. Wait, really? At least she is learning for her actions. Well, damn. I didn't really expect that. How long is Samantha gonna be in jail for? I for don't a know. Long, long time. Until y'all bail her out or something, at least. But there is more to the situation. I watched it the first time, so this is actually my second time watching it. Your father decided that he wanted to disown Samantha from the family. Wait, your job. Oh, let me see. Yeah, it works. Joking, right? No! No, this is dead serious. You know the subtitles are here. I'm afraid not. Now, thanks to my disgrace of a husband, she is no longer in the family. Well, honestly, that's really so. If you want it worse, you could put her her foster kid, but, it's, but yeah. Not gonna happen. Yeah, I wouldn't go to foster care for you, cause that would be, cause they have those harsh families here. They, most of them could be pedophiles soon. Don't send them to host to um foster care. Sucks. I mean, even if she is a troublemaker and a part of the worst gang in the Gonamut universe, she Correct. is still family. She is my sister. And she is your daughter. So wait, does this mean I no longer have a sister? Well, I wouldn't say that. Yeah, at least, at least I care for my sister. Yes. After we confront your father, we are gonna bring Samantha back into the family. Yep. Okay, that's good. Because I don't want to lose my sister. If anything, I want her to have a chance to turn over a new leaf. Agreed. A new leaf means uh, a new life, and aka, and the turnover means you just want to move on with your life. Look back at your actions, like like me as an example. As you remember that apology of the con video, after the actions I did in 2020, I actually explained why I did those. I did the WWE Immortal Speech Overs. I, it was really horrible. I'm not gonna do that ever again unless she wants it as a joke. Read. Now, let's go confront that ignorant excuse of a husband and father. Okay. Here we go again. You absolutely disgust the shit out. Oh, hey, yo, Pierre, you wanna come out here? <laughs> out of me. Um, guys, what is going on? And you know what's gonna happen. How come y'all are angry at me? You know damn well why we are angry at you. Yeah. You know you know damn well why you're angry at us. And I'm also angry at you for doing that stuff. Meet the Lime Twins. They're about to be cut up soon. This is their kids, Kanye and Pierre. Pierre's over there, and Kanye's the short one. You disowned our daughter. Yeah, mom told me every- Yeah. You, sh you should at least think about before disowning people. You didn't- Yeah, since you sexually abused Samantha, man. That's- That's messed up, man. What would you do with that? I should put you in Law and Order. Or in- Or Fatal Attraction. That could have been funnier and better. Law the difference between Law and Order and Fatal Attraction is- Law and Order is actually act is scripted, and Fatal Attraction is actually real. But, but what shows you should put his dad on? 
Fail, trash it, or law and order. You choose. Every single thing. How could you? How could you kick one of our family members out of the family? Lisa, don't you start with this bullshit. Yeah, Pierre. Pierre, shut up. Or I'm about to call a playboy card to summon you and beat your ass, man. <laughs> you know why. She is a troublemaker. That is why I kicked her out of the family. Dude, troublemaker or not, she's still your daughter. She may be. Why did I pronounce daughter? Daughter. Daughter. Like, and. Like, be gone. Thought. Like, why did I pronounce it like that? It's so horrifying. Be a troublemaker. You may have been a troublemaker, but even still. She may be or may. Have you don't ever do to send one of your children. It's true, Lisa. It's true, man. If I was in there, I would put no bug to look at her actions. That is just wrong. Not to mention that you blackmailed me by threatening to shoot me if I didn't sign the dissent papers. As we've seen in the previous episode, as we waited all day, and this is what the best plot we get. And when you were at the jail, you threatened to kill me and Samantha. Wait, what? You didn't tell me about that part. Is that what? Gagro. Really true? Yep. yep. I forgot to tell you, but he did You're all that to be me. All right. What the fuck, Dad? Are you serious? Please? Get your ass in the jail. We don't want to see you again. Threatened to kill Mom and Samantha. And threatened mom with a gun if she didn't disown Samantha. Yeah, this isn't Red Dead Redemption. Huh? Why? What kind of father are you? Wait, guys. I can uh, exp up, 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 We do not need you to explain this. We want you to get your in jail and do something. Try to be funny, but you don't. Explain. I had to do it. I can't believe you. You are an absolute monster. You didn't have to kick her out of the family, nor should you ever do such a despicable act. At least give her another chance. You could at least get, take her some counseling, like a like a very really better father you is. But no, you decided to go the hard way. What the f is wrong with you? I agree with mom. I mean, you could have gotten her some help. Maybe took her to a therapist. Or at least counselor, like I said before, and I said the first time I watched this video, which I actually commented when it came out. It, it was like an hour ago. Taking two hours ago. Although, thank you for animation sensation or two for, for hearting my comment. I really appreciate that, man. Best one ever. Oh, hold on. But no, your stupid fucking ass just had to disown her. What? Yup, I'm with Gerald this time. What are you gonna do? Disown me if I acted like Samantha? A good example. Very, very good example. Let's not forget the reason she is the way she is. You put her through a lot of physical and mental abuse. Look where it has gotten her and this entire family. Look at yourself. Look at you become. You should learn from your actions when we, when we see the next sequel. Oh, wait. We can't because he's in jail. I wish we all know what happens next. You know what, Peter? I've had enough of you. I am going to do something I should have done a long time ago. As of today, I want a divorce. Yay, hey, a divorce. Wait, what? No. Please, Lisa, don't divorce me. Too bad. Too bad. You're on your own. Oh, and you're gonna be arrested like I like it's in the title, but I'm gonna have to stop this because we're out of time. This is part one, by the way. Yeah, it's part one. And this is the first episode where I react with my beanie hat on. Bucket Hat series is no more, sadly. But we have it's it is season two. It'll be revealed in this in the season four finale.